Alright, so what we've got here is a complete and total mess of the workshop, but in the front here is uh, SWR Spectre um, undergoing the uh, dip treatment to clean it. You can see the fizzing there. Um, you only want to do this. Actually, you don't want to do this. Don't ever do this. This is bad, toxic, um, you know, cancerous and that sort of thing. Um, but this is the dip. I'm not going to tell you what's in it because I don't want to be responsible. But it'll shine up your suppressor nice and clean. This is the. I just put it in an old water bottle. And just let it let it do its thing. I just leave it in there until it's done. A day or two. However long it takes. But that's it. Eating the lead off, and what happens is uh the mixture, the the liquid mixture in there, um, with that lead in there, basically what happens is uh, you form lead acetate, and lead acetate is a known carcinogen. Um, so you have to dispose of this properly. Um, you want to make sure not to get it on you. I wear gloves and all that stuff um, when I'm messing with it afterwards. Um, anything this stuff touches is uh, is gone for good. That's why it's in the water bottle there. And a little uh, Chinese takeout bowl, dish, some fried rice. But, um, so yeah, I thought I'd just upload this and show. Somebody had asked on a forum or something what the dip was all about. Maybe Facebook, yeah, Facebook forum or something. But you can still see it. I think it's still going strong in there. It's one of the baffles. You can see there's still a little movement. Uh, there we go. Fizzing pretty good. That's what it'll do. Those those baffles will come out nice and shiny. You can see here at the top. A little bubbly action. It's like Alka Seltzer. Makes your uh Makes your cans tummy feel better.